He's going to break the surface with his head for this. His eyesight's very movement orientated, so when they do the tail walks, they pop up first. And when he's thinking about coming up, you'll see that tail start to twitch. That's where he gets his power from. And when they want to, they can get all the way out to the base of their tail. And some of our crocodiles here at the zoo actually get higher than this top rail, vertically straight up out of the water. And start doing it from the time they're little hatchlings, and still do it as adults. It's a little bit intimidating when you see past the rack. Okay. Like the size of the fish you go to say, Lisa. Alright. Well, it is winter, so the crocodiles are a little bit less active. They like it when it's really hot and steamy, humid in the summer. This pond is heated, but we are feeding them just a little bit less this time of year. I'll just try to bring them around. Well, hey. <laughs> Well, I guess it is only a little fish. Try to get him to look up. Oh. Right, so lesson there is very simple. Just don't climb out on anything which overhangs the water. And it is very simple. Get up there, Croc Country. I'll tell you what, it is some of the last frontier left on this planet. Where is it? Starts up.